All right, we are going to jump right over into Cricut Design Space and make us a name decal. Of course, the hardest part about making name decals is finding the perfect font. <laughs> so that always takes me a minute. The size we're going to go with today is eight for the width, three for the height. And of course, you change that right up here at the top. Always make sure you hit the lock button when you have it the size that you want it. And of course, we're going to hit make. I'm not going to save this project because typically when I put my name on stuff, I always use a different font. Yes, this is my last name, Mick Williams, and I put it on everything. <laughs> so we're going to be using the Cricut Joy Extra. You can see the size difference because I do have them side by side. So the one that's more of the teal color that is over to the right, that is the Cricut Joy. Um, the white one is the Cricut Joy Extra that was released earlier this year. Was it released earlier this year? Don't quote me on that. Um and we're going to be using this chocolate um, shimmer vinyl. So this is premium shimmer vinyl. The settings are in the little drop down box. So you don't have to try to figure out what settings to use to cut this particular vinyl because it is Cricut vinyl. There are grids on the back of it. So that's what I'm using to cut along the lines to make sure that I get a decent sized piece for the mat because like I said we're doing eight for the width three for the height um, so there will be some excess vinyl on the end but I am going to go ahead and place it onto the mat when you're using premium or well let me say permanence or removable vinyl the grid side always goes down onto your mat so Make sure that the vinyl is facing up so you can see whatever color the vinyl is. Um, so if it's removable or permanent, grid side down, you should be able to see the vinyl color facing you. Um, cutting off that little excess piece that's on the end right here. I typically don't keep the scraps anymore because I never go back and use them. So that little piece is going to go into the trash. I hate to say it. Sometimes crafting can be wasteful. But for the purpose of this video, we are going to be customizing something that we found at the Goodwill. My sister came over a couple weeks ago. Uh, we were in the she shed and she pulled out this cute little lap desk uh, while she was working on her laptop. And I'm like... I want one. But of course, when I went to go and look for them, they were like 30 bucks. I was like, no way. I was in my local Goodwill. Yes, I am also a thrifty girl. I love a good Goodwill find. And I found this one for $4.99. And of course, it was the right color. So I picked it up. So right now i'm just wiping it down uh with the disinfectant wipe of course getting the sticker off is always tedious i did not record taking the sticker off because of course it's wood so you have to be careful not to scratch it when you're removing the stickers sometimes a heat gun warm it up and it'll come right off depending on how long that sticker bit on there but we gave it a really good cleaning and look at it look at it isn't it cute okay so there is a little sticker residue so i did use some goo gong in this area right here i did not record it um but yeah goo gong is a crafter's best friend we just weeded our name and then oh my goodness y'all my brain just said ah and i'm not gonna redo this voiceover so we just weeded our name to Cal and we placed a, um, Jesus, what in the world is going on today? We placed a piece of, what is this called? Transfer tape. Yeah, my brain is just not, not working right now. So place a piece of transfer tape over the name decal. I did speed the video up because for some reason the back end did not want to come off and I didn't want to sit y'all down that long trying to watch that little piece. And we are going to place my name right in the center of it and give it a good little scrape with our scraper. This is the large Cricut scraper. You can use a debit card. You can use anything um, to scrape over it and then we're just gonna pull this off i did go into dollar tree they had some cute wall decals in there that matched the color theme 
of this lap desk so yes we could have printed it off but for $1.25 we're here now guys isn't this just the cutest it's cute so we are going to place them alongside the name and look at that you can't tell me to thank you well it's cute to me but now I have my own little lap disc so I can whip mine out when I go to my sister's house or when I'm at home because I do not have a desk upstairs. So it works out. But isn't it just the cutest? So for under 10 bucks, I have my own personalized little lap desk. These are the items that we used and this is how it turned out. The cutest.